Hello, and welcome back to my channel. I am Casual Geeky Gaming, and you can call me Casual. And this is my Detroit Become Human Let's Play. Now, if a man has not discovered something yep. he will die for, he's not fit to live. That's a quote from Martin Luther King. I thought you'd like it. And all kind, kinds of things happened in the last episode, and in this episode we will continue to see where the uh, story goes. So if you're geek to see where that story goes with me, scroll down, click like, click subscribe, leave me a comment, and uh, make sure you watch the video all the way through until the end so you get the full experience that I'm trying to bring to you. With that being said, let's uh, jump right on in. Boom. No reason to muck about. Let's hop right on in. Okay. And here we are, back with... Cecilia. I don't think that's her name. I don't think that that is her name. I can never remember this character's name. She uh, appears too infrequently, and I don't particularly care for her. Ever since that whole little... We saved our partner, we fostered relations between the humans, granted we missed that guy, and she pretty much called us a colossal failure. It's like, that's... That's, uh... That's a... Hello, Connor. Hello. I thought you might enjoy a little cruise. What is going on? There we go. A little fidgety to hit the right, uh... hit the right, um, angle or whatever. Yeah, well, alright. Oh, I, 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 when you say I would enjoy a little cruise, I mean I would enjoy taking you on a little cruise. I, I get it. I understand. Alright, Connor, let's do this. Let's do this. Boom. What a weird little garden thing. I love this place. Everything is so calm and peaceful. Far from the noise of the world. Tell me. What's up? What have you discovered? Um. I found two deviants at the Eden Club. I hope to learn something, but. I had to destroy them. Oh, well. You seem... lost, Connor. Lost and perturbed. He can't... he can't be... Ah, uh, for no, we're just determined. I'm just frustrated with my lack of progress. Heck yeah. But I'm determined to accomplish my mission. I shouldn't have lied. I should have said you were troubled. If your investigation doesn't make progress soon, I may have to replace you, Connor. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, let's say we're conflicted. I understand. Uh oh, that was an increase in software instability. Connor's gonna become Something's a deviant. Happening. Something serious. Hurry, Connor. Time is running out. Is there some correlation between Thunder and Android Deviancy that I'm not aware of? You're starting to piss me off with that coin, Connor. Sorry, Lieutenant. Yeah, Hank. You're our friend, man. Hi, Hank. Shit, what's going on here? There was a party and nobody told me about it? <laughs> yeah, it's all over the news, so everybody's buttoning their nose in. Even the FBI wants a piece of the action. Ah, Christ, now we got the feds on our back. I knew this was gonna be a shitty day. So what do we got? A group of four androids. They knew the building and they were very well organized. I'm still trying to figure out how they got this far without being noticed. Did you check the roof? Not yet. There's so much to look at. Mm. 
All right. Let's, let's make sure we check it out. They attacked two guards in the hallway. They probably thought the androids were coming to do maintenance. They got taken down before they could react. All right. Well, let's check. Oh, I guess not. Let's uh, keep holding down Q and following. When do we do the search for clues thing? The With the little blue. To get away. He's in shock. I'm not sure when we'll be able to talk to him. How many people were working here? Just two employees and three androids. The deviants took the humans hostage and broadcast their message live. Then made their getaway from the roof. The roof? Yeah, they uh. jumped with parachutes. We're still trying to figure out where they landed, but the weather's not helping. Well, one keep. If you want to take a look at the video broadcast by the deviants, it's on that screen over there. What screen? All right, let's do this. Check the rooftop. Oh, Lieutenant, this is Special Agent Perkins from the FBI. Lieutenant Anderson is in charge of investigating for Detroit police. What's that? My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. Androids investigating androids, huh? You sure you want an android hanging around? After everything that happened. Whatever. Jerk. The FBI have been taking over the investigation. You soon be off the case. Oh, pleasure meeting you. Have a nice day. And you watch your step. Don't fuck up my crime scene. Jerk. Oh, fucking prick. I'll give you that one. Nearby. Normally I say so language. Just ask. But I'll give you that one. Alright. All right. Let's have a look around. Let me know if you find anything. Okay, Lieutenant. Can do. Let's play. Let's see what he says. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life. Uh oh, that's not good. The time has come for you to give us freedom. I think that's our A9. Deviants say RA9 will set them free. This android seems to have that objective. Hmm. Clues to analyze. There we go. Well, let's uh, let's let's do this on up. Recorded at 1359.54. Deviant had accomplices. Blue Iris, spare part. So we know he's been replaced. RK series prototype RK200 registered as Marcus. A gift from Elijah K Komsky to Carl Manfred. You see something? Uh, I identified its model and serial number. Anything else I should know? No. Nothing. Oh, he's oh, and he knows it. Our android is turning, and he. Knows it. That's not good, Connor. That's not good, Connor. You better ship up, man. Ooh, what is that? Ooh, oh, okay, that's the roof access. Roof access. What's this guy doing? Um. Hmm. Well, he's still doing that. Do we analyze the coat rack? Let's analyze the coat rack. Oh, bullet holes. Never mind. Alright. Well, let's keep, uh... Searching, eh? Yeah. Connor's becoming unstable, man. Check CCTV. Yeah, Connor's becoming unstable, and I think, uh, Lieutenant Anderson knows. And I think, uh, Lieutenant Anderson knows. They didn't break in? No, no signs of forced entry. There are cameras in the hallway. The staff would have seen what was happening. Why did they let him in? Maybe they didn't check the cameras. All right.
Ooh, what is this? Let's do this. Let's turn some. Oh, and uh, they were androids. We stored the station androids in the kitchen. There's no evidence that they were involved, but we didn't know what else to do with them. Interrogate the androids in the kitchen. Well, let's go. Uh, hey, come on, Lieutenant Anderson. Let's go. I'm not a deviant. I'm not a deviant. Let's go. Ah, here they are. How you doing? Hello, I'm Connor. LED lights were in. Look for a reaction to spot the deviant. Okay. Function model. Well, let's, uh... What is your function? I am a broadcast operator. What's your model? State your model. Model GB300. Serial number 336-445-581. Um... Dot diagnostic? Witness. Were you present when the deviants broke in? I do not remember. You do not remember? What do you mean you don't Has remember? Has anybody accessed your memory recently? Not to my knowledge. Well, let's run... Run a diagnostic. All systems fully operational. Have you been in contact with any other androids recently? Only station androids in the normal course of my function. Alright. One of you saw the attack on the surveillance cameras and said nothing. Which means there's a deviant in this room. And I'm going to find out which it is. Wait. Did I see him move? Uh, I don't know. Guilt? Why should you all be destroyed if only one is deviant? Turn yourself in, or two innocent androids yep, will be shut dude. down because of you. Found him. It's middle dude. Uh, come on, guy. If you give yourself up, Maybe I can convince the humans not to destroy you. Don't we know for a fact that it's this dude? You're going to be switched off. We're going to search your memory and tear you apart piece by piece for analysis. You're going to be destroyed. Do you hear me? Destroyed! All right, yeah, Connor. All right. Ah, what's pro memory? Oh, come on. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. But he said that. Uh, bluff? The deviants have just been caught. They gave you up. There's no point in lying. They know everything. Ah, uh, should I try threatening one of the other ones? Uh, this seems unethical. Component eight four five. This seems unethical. Regulates the heartbeat. Without this module, you'll shut down in exactly sixty three seconds. I could put it back, but you just have to tell me the truth. Are you the deviant? Put it back. Put it back. Let's keep threatening. I got no problem with this. I'm not gonna keep- scumbag! I know it's you! You're just a fucking deviant! Go on! Admit it! Um... That didn't work out that well. You know there's a deviant among them. Uh-oh.
Did I just fail something? I just failed something. That's not good. I shouldn't have kept threatening the middle guy. I should have did something different. Oh, that's not good. I thought we seen him react, though. What's he doing? <laughs> He's practicing the uh, coin trick. That's kind of funny. Alright. Oh, that was just unpleasant. I, I should have... I thought we seen him react. That's what I was trying to do. That guy's a jerk. Alright. I think we failed the no deviant among them. I don't know what that means, though. I thought, uh, I thought Connor determined that there was a deviant among them. Reported missing. So somebody was shot. Ah, we're learning. Ooh, what's this? Let's go see what this is. Okay. We're disguised. Bam. Oh, there's even more over here. Reported missing. 231602. Okay. February. I have no idea what they did. February 16th? Yeah. Oh, that's kind of cool. He's getting better at it. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. Keep analyzing, friend. You got this. Alright, so... Um... What are we what are we thinking? What are we thinking? Ooh. Okay. Alright. So we failed I'm pretty sure we failed that uh no deviant among them. Because we kept uh we kept um threatening the same dude over and over and over again. But I thought I saw him in my defense. I thought I saw him, uh... I thought I saw him... Ooh! I thought I saw him do something. I, saw, I thought I saw him twitch. Alright. I don't know, what do we do? Go, do we go back in the kitchen? Can we, can, can we get a second crack at it? I'd like to get a second crack at it. If at all possible. Nope, no second crack. Ooh, no, that's probably not gonna be good. Okay. Back out here. Let's see. Oh, never mind, resume. Never mind. Resume. Can we talk to that lady? No? Alright. Can we talk to this guy? No? How about you? Alright, alright, alright. Hmm. Not that guy either. Hey, CSI fella, what can you tell me? Well, let's see if we can't go uh, up the roof access then, I guess. Let's see if we can't go up to the roof access and see what happens. Let's see, Ben. Okay.
made their way up through the whole building, past all the guards, and jumped off the roof with parachutes. Pretty fucking impressive, I'd say. Looks like it. Oh, I didn't finish inspecting the... That's not good. Um... Oh. Deviant left behind. Follow the blood traces. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's finish. How'd they manage to smuggle in a big bag like that? They didn't. Someone brought it in for them. Oh, that's strange. They planned a perfect operation, but got the number of parachutes wrong. No, they didn't. Unless one of the deviants was left behind. Alright, let's uh, continue on then. Standard issue. Partially covered by the snow. Alright, uh, let's scooch on back. We think the Deviant went this way, right? Can I go in here? Nope. Alright. Um. How about over here? No? Alright, alright, alright. Moving on. Um, oh, wait, wait, how do I... Deviant left behind, ooh. Can we track? He's over here, right? There we go. It's open. Oh, holy crap! You have to stop them! If they destroy it, we won't learn anything! We can't save it, it's too late! We'll just get ourselves killed! Uh... Charge the Deviant, let's go! Oh, we got it. Connor. Connor, you all right? Connor. I'm okay. Are you hurt? I'm okay. Jesus. Oh, you scared the shit out of me. For fuck's sake, I told you not to move. Why do you never do what I say? I was connected to its memory. Because you're kind of rid? When it fired... I felt it die. Like I was dying. I was scared. Hey, no. He's not supposed to feel any. That's a problem. I saw something. In its memory. A word. Painted on a piece of rusty metal. Jericho. That was our bad, man. <sighs> um, wait, what just happened? No, okay, so Connor was traumatized. Um, investigate the broadcast room. We needed to find whatever this was to continue the broadcast room one. Oh, the deviant was not found. Interrogate androids. We needed to find the deviant. Oh, I don't. I. Ooh, what is? Oh, we didn't even investigate the quarters. That was just our bad. All right. Oh, hold on. Time out. Don't do that. Main menu. So this is when I'd like to bring this episode to an end. Um. This is the point of the episode when I just wanted to say thank you. I'm glad you made these decisions last time. This 
is our story. Yes. So this is the point of the episode where I just wanted to say thank you. I know you can spend your time doing anything you wanted, and if you made it with me this far, you decided to spend it with me. And for that, I am sincerely and truly appreciative. And if you're geeked about it too, scroll down, click like, click subscribe, leave me a comment, and make sure you watch. Uh, make sure you come back for the next exciting episode of Detroit Become Human. And with that, I am out. See ya.